find that game. Here he is, Timo Ball. The left handed sensation, Gauzy. Excellent feel for the ball as well. He even outdid Shu Sheen. That carries responsibility and fills hope in the hearts of this French crowd that are here to support. Stable and consistent. Kicks off the end of the table. Of European table tennis. As you can see there, wrong foot in Gauza. Instinctive prediction of where the ball's going to come to. against Poland. It's worth mentioning as well what France have done remark. Despite the seeding suggesting they are expected to do so, but they came back. And now deservedly face the top seeds. And done it all. Convincingly. Oh, he's just got always there. Playable at the moment. Gauze is not playing badly whatsoever. It's just Ball's got that little bit extra. Formidable fight. Oh, Gauze is coming across it twice. Oh! Whoa! A table tennis Gauze is capable of. How on earth has he done that? stable at the moment. To the extent that he carried the German flag at the Olympic Games opening ceremony in Rio. Thank <laughs> you. 
Coming at the ball to Peter Flick. There we see it. Coming around the middle of the ball. That was the understanding that. The crowd almost insisting. Some equilibrium. Ball with the pendulum. Who's it gonna be? Gowns has saved yet another game point. Not this time, but key to proving effective for Gowns Gowns will be disappointed because he had a game point of his own. Attention. Perfect shot, please.
with the blocks is something to behold. Oh. We're going to see a timeout from the French side. How's Patrick Sheila after doing that about now? And he does. Timeout to the fence. In his late thirties, he's still just as good. He grinds out some of his results. Been around for a very long time. Seen the change in the ball from cellular to plastic. He had to adapt to that. He's had to. He had to adapt to ageing while playing. The epitome of any good sportsman. Excellent. To create any attacking opportunity. But then Gauzy shows initiative with the flick. Gauzy, the show must go on. Say the French crowd. Strawberry on that occasion. So consistently, we see Simon Gauzy revving up the back. We've been have to be perfect from ball to make that sh that shot. Look at that backhand. He came for. Such a perfect backhand from Simon Gauzy. To throw a ball off guard here, let's have a look. Well, a seemingly desperate backhand does it. Simon Gauzy is on the scoreboard. Timo Ball returning to the German corner. How's he going to make a canny comeback? Rabbit and headlights in the first two sets. Ball to start at the beginning of this fourth end. Well, all of has changed. Each fans beginning to believe that their man has what it takes. Set pieces. Ball flat footed to the wide forehand. So with some talent there, but Simon Gauzy, you know, there we see Ball's swooping side shot. I remember seeing him play that shot at the China Open against to the fanatic Frenchman. Ooh, spots the open side. The spin on those pendulum serves of his. What a rally. Oh, Gauzy swooping down, but balls there as usual. Brilliant rally prolonged by some amazing work from Timo Ball. Gauzy trying to send him the wrong way and then do the same again. Done the same. Ball going for the diving hand switch shot. Boom. We've seen Timo Ball make that shot against Chuan Chi Wan at last year's T2 League. Be too wide on that occasion. Well, what to cheer about. 
He has risen from the dust to Europe's finest. The strawberry that ball cut. the same but the tensions rise do him a whole load of favours if he could ooh Gowsey bends well that back on that he made before being steady helping the heart rate not to fluctuate Gowsey good crowd the Germans Was in. Upsetting the French hearts in this opening match. Simon Gauzy with the snake shot. Does he get to that one? He does. Oh! He gets to that one as well. No way! Oh my goodness me, what a finish! That would have been unbelievable if Gauzy. A deflated look on the face of Simon Gauzy, but there isn't too much reason to worry yet. Remember, they were 2-0 down against Poland in yesterday's quarter-final. They came back from being buried alive in Germany's quarter-final yesterday. They played against Slovenia. There, it wasn't as easy as maybe they would have liked, but at the end of the day, the job got done. The home side, France. Simon Gauzy waves to the crowd in thanks for the support that he received, but he'll be upset that he couldn't.